The House has resumed and the House is debating the first reading of the Waitaki District Council Reserves and Other Land Empowering Bill. Phil Twyford has the call. He has three minutes remaining. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Um, we're discussing this evening the uh, Waitaki District uh, Reserves and Council Reserves and Other Land Empowering <coughs> Bill. And as I was saying before the break, Labor is supporting <coughs> this bill to select committee, sir. Um, but we do so with the intention that, that elements of this seemingly uncontroversial bill should get proper scrutiny at select committee. And I was focusing my comments before the dinner break on one of the three blocks of land which is known as um, Forrester Heights, also known as Lookout Point. And um, this, like, like the other two blocks of land dealt with by this bill, uh, the council believes that that administrative errors uh, conferred on the, on the blocks uh, reserve status when in fact it should have been treated as an endowment. Now the council wants to um, dispose of the land and Lookout Point is, uh, is, uh, has been earmarked for a subdivision, a 5.8 uh, hectare subdivision, 27 sections, sir, um, on Cape uh, Wanbro, which is above Amaru Harbour. Um, the reason that we think this deserves scrutiny, sir, at Select Committee, is that it involves the disposal of a publicly owned asset uh, for private gain. And um, uh, taken at face value, that may be perfectly fine. But as I was saying before, the party on that side of the House has form in this area. They believe that selling assets is our uh, national economic development strategy and um, they, they are quite happy to dis dispose of, of assets in the public good um, for private gain. And there's another bill, sir, that we recently sent off to select committee, a, uh, a local bill, the South Taranaki District Council Cold Creek Rural Water Supply Bill, which involves transferring a council-owned water supply scheme into private hands. And there are all sorts of allegations surrounding that bill, sir, of improper pressure brought to bear on the local council and a good deal of local controversy. So I think there's reason to tread carefully. Um, it's all too easy for lawyers, councillors, politicians, real estate agents um, uh, to use their informal relationships and networks uh, to um, extract private gain from public resources. And, and, and I think it's a, it's a fundamental principle of our democracy that our public resources should be managed in the public good and in the public interest and that's something that we should fiercely protect. So that's the principle, sir, that's at stake. Um, we, we support this local bill brought to the House by uh, Jackie Dean and, um, and to Select Committee. We support it to Select Committee and we look forward to really properly scrutinising the, the provisions of this bill. Five minute call starting with Nikki Kaye. I'm very pleased to speak on the Waitaki District Council Reserves and other